Hey guys, my name is Sidi Egg and welcome back to Bloxburg Rags to Riches. It's been a while since we last played uh, this series. Apologies on the delay for this episode coming out, guys. We are back and if you don't know what this series is, I highly recommend starting from the beginning. It's where we start off super poor in Bloxburg and try and become super rich and build the biggest and best mansion in the whole entire world without cheating, without buying money, spending Robux, none of that. We've got to go from rags to riches, guys. Like, legit. Legit. Poor to rich. We've got to grind this out. Uh, last time we played this, we really expanded it. There's somebody at my window. Um, hey, how you doing? You got any cash, buddy, Moonlight, you want to give your boy? Probably not. My dude stinks right now. Uh, last time I was here, right, we kind of completed and built the upper floor. Which, at the moment, it only holds a bedroom. Which I'm not fully happy with this bedroom. It'll eventually become the guest bedroom. But I want to try and get enough money today to try and expand further out to build a bigger and better bedroom for your boy. Now, before we go any further, then we do have a downstairs little bathroom. I do need to use this shower. I'm not feeling too good. Now, since we played last time, I've been saving, guys. I have been playing this a lot, uh, you know, in, in the last few weeks, just trying to get some money together. Uh, we're doing pretty well. We've actually ranked up some pretty high jobs as well. Uh, let me check my mood. My mood. The hygiene's always there. that. We'll feed ourselves up with a little bit of hunger. We could go to like, the little Seniac uh, burger little, uh, van place. Let's open this door up. Um, I, I want to open the door. There we go. Hey, dude, how you doing? Come with me. Dude, we'll have some burgers together. They'll be delicious. This is a little business I set up, well, which went really well. I, you know, I've been able to make quite a bit of cash money moolah from this. I'm going to grab a hot dog anyway and eat this because your boy is pretty hungry. Where, where am I taking this? Place hot dogs. Yeah, place hot dogs. I, I want to take a portion. There we go. <laughs> Eat it. It's going to be tasty. Tasty. We're going to take a taco too. We're going to a hot dog. We're going to have a taco. Your boy's going to get super fat after eating all of this stuff. Damn. Right, my mood is good. What's my work like? You see, I'm level 9 as being a janitor. So that's pretty decent. You get some good money there. We're going to kind of go out and head out now because it is, this is the first time um, I've kind of like showed you guys on camera being, you can kind of say it's the Halloween update, but it's it's the fall update where everything's all like autumn-y. Why are we heading out in our super, oh, that person's got a swimming pool in their front garden. That's how you know they're ballers. I like the pattern of that house with the little sprinklers and that pattern's really nice too. Guys, wow, look at that house. People are building some pretty, pretty impressive houses and buildings right now. So we're going to go and take it all the way over now to uh, the cleaning area. We're going to do a little bit of cleaning, get a little bit of money. I want to try and get another $600, ran it off to about 11000 And that should be more than enough to what I need to, uh, you know, guys, build and expand my house. Because it's actually starting to get really, really big now, which I'm really excited about. So if you guys have any suggestions on what you want me to do next in the series, what you'd like me to see me doing this rags to riches, uh, let me know in the comment section down below. I'm going to keep an eye on my work right now. It's a little bit hard to see because I'm kind of in the way, but let me go. Whoa! City where are you going? Whoa! Let's just move over there a little bit. <laughs> right, and you can kind of see all my little statistics now. So clean up. We just need to get uh, 550 is the perfect amount of cash money moolah dollars that we need. So we're going to run around now, clean up various little sections. I see some little soda cup over there right now. So we're actually doing pretty well. Somebody's just made me a guest of their place. Nice. You know, donation won't go, you know, amiss. <laughs> just saying. Just saying. <laughs> right, there's more stuff down this alleyway as well. So we got 185. We only need 550. And there's uh, there's two things here to clean up. So that'll push me around about the 300 mark once we've got that done. So it'll probably give me about 280, believe it or not. Damn, boy. I'm earning so much money from being a janitor. Everyone keeps saying, like, the pizza delivery makes you the most money. And, yeah, it is It is kind of right. Like, if you compare delivering one pizza per cleaning one mess here, yes, pizza delivery makes more money. But how long does it take to deliver one pizza? And how, in that time I deliver one pizza, how many cleaning ups can I do as a janitor? Think about that. Let's say, right, it's a it's hundred dollars to deliver one pizza. No, let's just say it's one fifty to deliver one pizza. 
But as a janitor, you get $60 per cleaning. Now, let's say by the time it takes that one person to deliver one pizza it makes $150, I could have done, let's say, for example, uh, four cleaning like jobs here. And in that time, the pizza delivery made $150. If I did four, I made $240. That's how you gotta think about it. It's basically what can you do the most in a short period of time? And that's how you earn the most cash money moolah. So with me talking absolute nonsense right now, if I end my shift, I should have 11,000. Nice. Is my car still there? Where's my car? Yeah, my car is still here. Sometimes the car likes to disappear and I'm left stranded. Right, let's get back into the Seti Mobile. The world's greatest car the world has ever seen, guys. Don't judge. Appreciate. Appreciate the vehicle right now. We're tooting along, singing a song. Your boy is driving one million miles an hour. Right, let's cut, cut across the grass then. So we're going to do some building, some upgrading. Try and get that second bedroom on the go right now. And then once we get that second bedroom, we've got like the main bedroom, which is what, you know, my bedroom. Then we have the secondary bedroom, the guest room. And then for now, I think we're kind of done with the house. Uh, like, a little bit. I want to focus on, like, the back garden, setting up a swimming pool, maybe doing something with the uh, uh, the restaurant, maybe expand, maybe actually turn it into a fine dining restaurant. That would be kind of cool, wouldn't it? Right, so I want to go now into build mode. There we go. And we're going to do some upgrades right now. So first things first then, we're going to go to build. Uh, no, we're going to actually go to demolish. Get rid of that roof there. Get rid of this window. And I think that should be okay. We'll use this little kind of cutting area there uh, as, as like a bathroom. So we need to do flooring then. So not doors. What am I doing? What am I doing? Floors! Now you can't see what I'm selecting. Whoa, Sediac! Whoa, we're flying, guys! Whoa! <laughs> right, floors. Okay, let, let's uh, let's play auto place this down. <laughs> uh, ignore me. Well, we need to go upper floor. There we go. Try and zap all of this in. There we go. So now we're gonna build the walls, and we gotta be quite smart with the walls. Well, I'll get you know what? I'm gonna delete this roof as well, so we can kind of see what we're actually physically working with. Oh no! I came out of build mode. Damn, Ceniac, Ceniac. You are doing an episode. What's this? Maybe. <laughs> uh, okay, build mode. Sorry, dude. You need to get kicked out a little bit there. Right, okay. So we got the floor down then. Walls. Oh, my good God. See, I said to that dude, maybe, and he donates 1,300. That dude is a le legit legend. What's his name now? He's called Dan... Daniel Luce. If I'm pronouncing your name wrong, dude, I am so, so sorry, but I greatly appreciate it. I greatly appreciate it, guys. Let's get a hashtag Daniel. Drop in, drop in money bombs right now. Oh, my good God. Right, Daniel, appreciate it, homeboy, but your boy has to build his beautiful, beautiful bedroom. Right, so I'm thinking then that I get rid of this closet. And make it the closet of this room. Or the bathroom. Or the... Ooh, I got an idea. Oh, I just had an idea, guys. If I do that like that, it will make sense. And then kind of... Ooh, this this could be... Nah, this could be slightly dangerous. If I do it like... Um, like this. If I run it all the way across like that. And actually delete this. Because I could keep the closet there. I've got an idea. Walls... Like that. Now, it all comes down to the doors, if the doors work. It, you're probably thinking, Sonny, like, what are you doing right now? You, this makes no sense. Please, can't, have we got doors on that one yet? Yeah. Uh, trust me, this will make complete sense. So, what type of door do I have there? It's just a standard door, isn't it, mate? Yes. So, a standard door there. And I want to get these big open archways. So, if I have an archway open there, then an elaborate one, like the big boy one. So why? Oh, I can't place it there because it's classed as two walls, isn't it? Yeah. Right, there we go. I, it's weird when the game does that. It should, like, automatically create or link those walls up because they're going in the same direction, if that makes sense. Right, doors. 
and this will make uh, sense. So this is the bedroom. We have the bed against this wall here. This is the big walk-in closet, and as you got the big walk-in closet, you got the walk-in ensuite with the bathroom and stuff. Oh my good god, this is going to be so damn dope. I'm so impressed already. Okay, so let's cancel that. We need to get windows on the go. Windows! And we'll get these beauties in. So we'll have... Now, I won't put a window there, because that's where the bed's going to be. We'll put the uh, window here. Right. We'll get a... Should I get one of, the, like, this window that we got there and pull it here? It could be quite cool. And we do the same there. Now, do we have a bathroom window? We do, but we'll go with the four one. The free one, sorry. Like that. That's going to be pretty dope. Okay, so we're going to decorate this quickly then. Ah, oh, this is annoying now. Right, hold on, guys, because it's all, it's, it's all classes one floor. So floors... There we go. Floor. There we go. Floor. There we go. Beautiful, guys. So floor in here, we'll get it to be the same as this one. Floor in the closet, we're going to be the same as that one. Now, I'll leave the bedroom floor for now. We're going to make the bathroom walls be all the same. This is the time-consuming bit right now. I'm trying to get this all up to be similar. Oh, that's class as... Oh, my good God. That's now class as... Um, one wall. See what I mean? Sometimes, Bloxburg, you annoy me. I want to do simple tasks, but you won't let me do a simple task. I never, okay, remind me, guys, I got to pull a window there. All right, turn, drop that there. Good. I'm going to keep the same closet color going through because I really like that color. Have oh, we got that the right way around? No, we haven't even got this the right way around. There we go. Oh, now that one's classed as one wall. Guys, I'm going to cry. I'm legit going to cry. We'll do the windows after. We'll do the windows after. Right, boot. No. No! <laughs> How does that happen? How does that legit happen? The game, the game is hating me right now. Right, windows come later. Don't worry. Right, so get all this in. That all in. Now, doorways, obviously, they're white. And this doorway here, we'll just make sure it's all selected as the same as that one. This is the same as these ones. Okay, what color scheme are we going for the bedroom, then? Now, we've got a blue in there. Let's see what kind of uh, kind of a texture. Oh, we've got, like, are these all different shades. These are different shades, aren't they? Oh, my good God. Right, let me just select the wood texture first. Oh, guys, this looks so good. I like that little, t like, tinge on it. These look so nice. When did they update them like this? Red. Oh, that red's so nice. Right, we're going to go for that type of brown. Now, walls, then. I'm going to make it decorative. We could go for that. That's quite decorative. Maybe something like that. Mm. Icy. Maybe not. Maybe the stripes. I like the stripes. And let's see. Should I go for like a lighter? It's like they've added in so many more colors and stuff right now. It's so hard to choose what would be the best thing to go for. Well, let me select the same as that, but then like do it like a different... No, it's the pattern that changes it. The pattern's changing how it looks. Keep it plain? Nah. Brick? No. No, 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 no. What about the diagonal one? Where's the diagonal pattern? Where's that? Nah, I'm not a fan of that now. Oh, darker. Yes. Making it a lot darker. Right, there we go. This is going to be so good when we get it all set up, guys. Trust me. I'm an interior genius. I'm not. I'm not. I am. No, I'm not. <laughs> right, get all that in. Right, sweet. That's all in. Now we just do the outside of the house. Get all that up and running. Now I go do windows. Can't forget those beauty of a window. Right there. Boom. Boom. Okay, that's now all in. 
So build uh, windows. Where's the windows? Windows. Okay, let's go back to as we was. Oh, wrong type of window frame I've got there already. All right, that one goes in there. And then we'll have the small one there. And then the free one just there. And now we decorate them. To be the same as everything else we got in here. Right, good stuff. Okay, we've done all that then. We've got it all set up. We need to put a roof on it. But do I leave the roof till last? I mean, you can hide the roof. So, do you know what? I'll put the roof on now. So, roof. We'll go for this maced roof. And we'll auto place it because it's going to be a bit awkward. There we go. And then we just paint that to be the same as the garage roof. And that is our beautiful roof. Right, let's just put the roof down in so I can get all the furniture now in. So, decorate them. We want beds. And I'm going all out, guys. Don't even care right now. I don't think I'm about to squeeze that in, right? Does it hang out if I built it in? Like, just out of interest. Yeah, it goes through. <laughs> it goes through. Okay, maybe not quite that bed. Maybe not quite that bed. We'll go for the... Oh, we got like a camping tent. We got the, the canopy bed. I like this one though. The industrial bed has like a headboard. But then we got the curved bed. Or an oof coffin. Now we're going to go with this one. Right. Which wall do I place it on? I feel like I want it there. Yeah, but let's go to a smaller grid. So, yeah, we'll place it. Yeah, we'll just place it there. That's fine. Okay, we've got the bed in. Uh, I want now cabinets. No, this is for the kitchen, not cabinets, sorry. I need storage. Nice no, tables! Storage. All right, we go for big boy storage. Industrial wardrobe. Now, that sounds, like, mental. Oh, that's, per that's perfect, guys. That's exactly what I want right there. Right, and we'll drop some like little storage stuff around, like a little chest of drawers, or a dresser there, should I say. Uh, any shelf stuff. I like these little crazy shelves. Where could I place that? Oh, no, that they don't go on the wall. I want something that goes on the wall. There we go. Crazy bookshelf. There we go, there we go, there we go. And then uh, we'll get some... Let me get some lights in. Lights in. Now, we've got the spinning ones there. I want to keep that up. Is it classed as a simple fan or is it these ones? It's the elegant fan, isn't it? Right, one in there. One in there. We don't have one of those in the bathroom, though. We have one of those oblong lights. It's not that one. It hangs from the ceiling. This one. Boom. There we go. So, let's get the bathroom stuff in now. We're now only down to, like... Damn, 5,000, guys. We're spending all the monies. All the monies. Right, plumbing. I do know you can get new bathtubs, which is quite cool. We're gonna, should we place like a little corner bath in there? Yes, please, if I can get that in. Boom. Guys, that is going to look so good. Right, we get a little toilet in. Where's a good toilet? Should we just go for this one, the tilt toilet? There we go. We just need a sink on this side. Elegant sink. Oh, not that one. Sorry, I want the one, that one here, the modern sink bowl. The UT4. So very basic, but it works. I got 1,500 left. See what I mean by I needed 11,000? Don't ask me how I knew. I don't know. But we need it. Right, tables. I like these little, we'll use, can I, I can't really squeeze one down there, can I? No, can we get really thin ones? Nightstand. None of them are that thin, are they? So you might be able to get away with just having one. We'll put it like diagonal like that. I just want to put a lamp on it. That's kind of all I really want to do with that. So lighting. Do I go for a nice lava lamp? 
You know what I'm gonna? I, I love using these little lava lamps. They're so good. Right, let's decorate the colour of them then. So let me just do the bed quickly. So get rid of those pillars. Make them nice and dark. Nice! Um, same goes for this. I'm just trying to make it the same colour scheme going throughout. I just noticed that this is not the colour scheme, well, the pattern that I want. Nice little wood pattern. And we'll go, should we go for a green lava lamp just to like be different? I feel like we should. Everything else is pretty much fine. So let's get out of build mode. That dude is still here. He, he, this dude's fell asleep. Right, let's go upstairs then. We've got this new, oh, the bath is hanging out a little bit. I'll fix that, don't worry. But let's open up to our new boudoir. I like this. I like this a lot. And our new bath, which I should have used it, made it white to fill it in. It doesn't actually quite touch the edges of the wall correctly. But it's pretty dope though, isn't it? It is pretty dope that you can like, have like a huge bathtub right now. I'm super impressed with it. I'm super impressed. Can I get into bed? Sleep. Night, night, everybody. Your boy is now slowly got himself a beautiful mansion. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this little episode. Then if you want to see me do some more fun, cool stuff in Rags to Riches, let me know what you want to see me do in the next coming episodes. There's a lot of things that I want to try and do, like build the outside, like a swimming pool, get the garden all and area nicely set up. The house, even though it's actually quite big, I still want to get even bigger. I want more bedrooms, more rooms. I want like a games room, PC room. I want everything in here right now. Everything. So guys, give me some suggestions of what you see me do next then. I've got a, a huge list of what I want to do. Is this you what you want to see first? So hope you did enjoy it. If you did, smash that like button down below. Until next time, I'll see you all soon. So good. Bye. Listen.